What's up? Brandon Costello here from Mountain Bike Action, and today we'd like to introduce you to the all-new Santa Cruz Bronson, a bike that pays homage to the street where Santa Cruz's headquarters once inhabited. Born in 2013, the Santa Cruz Bronson shook up the mountain bike market with its in-between wheel size known as 650B. Promising the best qualities of the two most popular wheel sizes of that time, 27 and a half inch wheels became the obvious choice for that versatile trail machine. With a nod of the hat to Santa Cruz's roots and the industry's most talked about wheel size, the Bronson grew into the well-regarded bike it is today. The Bronson received further updates in 2016, but it wasn't until 2018 when the Bronson's styling and geometry really began Again to get shaken up. The all new Bronson was drastically redesigned with a new lower link mounted shock, mimicking the Nomad but in a shorter travel package. The new link allowed Santa Cruz to give the Bronson a more linear feel, aiding in small bump sensitivity while retaining a supportive mid-stroke and progressive bottom out. An additional upright was added to the rear triangle to enhance the bike's ability to track the trails and increase torsional stiffness. Along with these changes, the Bronson's reach grew by 15 millimeters per frame size and its standover lowered by 10 millimeters. The seat tube was pushed one degree forward to 75.3 degrees, aiding in climbing performance, and the seat tube was shortened by a full inch to allow for longer travel dropper posts. Additional features include a threaded bottom bracket, internal cable routing, the ability to run a bottle cage inside the front triangle, and a rear shock cover for added protection. Shuttle junkies need not to worry about scratching up their frames as Santa Cruz added a protective guard underneath the top tube for riders who like to shuttle their bikes lap after lap. Our Bronson Carbon CC frame came with a SRAM X01 build kit sitting just behind the SRAM XX1 and Shimano XTR builds. Although our bike wasn't the most expensive in Santa Cruz's lineup, it still boasts a top dollar price tag, but offers a quality list of components suited for elite level riders. Featuring Santa Cruz's in-house reserve carbon wheels, 160 millimeter travel Fox 36 Performance Elite Fork, and a RockShox Super Deluxe Shock, this Bronson is not one to bat an eye at. The Santa Cruz carbon handlebar along with a race face stem complete the cockpit while SRAM brakes and a RockShox dropper post round out the build. A pair of Burley Maxxis rubber wraps the wheels ensuring maximum traction and promoted confidence. We made a few upgrades to our Bronson, including a pair of Magura MT7 brakes for superior braking performance and control. Next, we added an XX1 crank set complete with a 4i power meter, offering precise power measurements. Find the full review for these products in the January issue of Mountain Bike Action. This new version of the Bronson is longer, slacker, and lower than its previous iteration, while also gaining a stiffer rear end and an all-new suspension platform. However, the roots of the Bronson remain the same. It's still a bike designed to be as versatile as possible, whether blasting up steep single track or dancing around technical lines. Closely resembling Santa Cruz's Nomad, the big brother to the Bronson, you might be fooled into thinking that the Bronson's platform is purely built for descending. The suspension is actually quite efficient. In fact, our testers never felt the need to reach down for the compression lever, which was a good thing as that low-mounted shock really requires a rider to reach for that lockout switch. The Bronson isn't a bike that blows you away with acceleration during climbs, but manages to translate power to the ground well. While the Bronson is surely capable of making its way up to the top of the trail, it's the way back down when the bike truly shines. Santa Cruz built this bike with a 65.4 degree head tube angle and short 430 millimeter chain stays. The combination of the 150 millimeter travel wheels and a stout frame all came together to make this Bronson an absolute animal during the descents. While long travel 29ers have grown in popularity, the Bronson sticks to its guns with 27.5 inch wheels. And for many riders, they wouldn't have it any other way, as it's those small wheels that make this bike oh so fun. The Bronson charges down the trail with precision and authority while retaining a playful side. If an all around shredder is in your short list of bikes to purchase, look no further than the all new Bronson. Want to read the full review? Head to the January issue of Mountain Bike Action. And for all the latest on bike tests, news, and reviews, head to mbaction.com.
Hey, did you like that review and want to watch another? Click the link below and don't miss out on any of the action by clicking subscribe. Come on, you know you want to.